Hey guys, it is a super exciting day. Um, not only have I not painted in a few days, I have new supplies. Yay! So I bought, I've never purchased uh, Grumbacher. I got these. I'm super excited. Cerulean blue magenta. Dioxas Dioxas Zine purple, cadmium orange hue, and then I got myself a cake spatula to scoop the white, hopefully into the Ziploc, and not waste so much stinking white paint. So, oh, and I my glue glove, glove, blue gloves back. I'm so excited it came and taught. Yay, no more saggy gloves. Um, so I'm super excited. Um, and I got other new exciting paint stuff, but that will wait till my next video. I haven't tried those yet. Um, so I've got a 10 by 20 inch canvas. I already mixed up my paints. I mixed um, the paint with Floetrol, then mixed in Liquitex pouring medium and then added water and my white is Dutch Boy mixed the exact same way as these. All my paints are always mixed the exact same way except these I added into them um, WD-40 silicone, black can silicone. So I'm not going to spray the flip cup with silicone since I already added it into the paints. Um, so I'm going to make up my dirty cup and we're going to see what we got going on here. Um, I'm used to working with my canvas the other way, but it wasn't looking very good on the camera. so. Let me see, because I may have to end up tilting it all directions, so let's see if that's still in the frame. And it is. That's good to know. Just keep it like this for a little bit. Um, so, do do do. Go ahead and blue first. I'm going to do a flip and drag. I had trouble deciding what colors to buy because I knew I couldn't buy a whole bunch. So I had trouble deciding what colors. I didn't realize that this purple was so dark. Even like the little sample that they had, um, like I did not imagine that it was going to be that dark. I mean, it's pretty, but it's just much darker than I imagined it would be. Right. You know what I'm going to do? I am putting... Uh, I feel like being a wuss today. And I'm putting extra padding under my knees. sensitive today. So, actually, that's good. Um, let's start here. So, that's probably an ounce of paint. Oh, look at that. Look at it just all come out. So, my plan of saving a lot of the white I suppose it'll still work on this end, just not on um, that end. I'm hoping that that, because that end, it's going to be stained. Ah, oh, it'll work good if I did it this way. I 
And now this looks really weird, guys. And it is probably not the most logical way to do this. But, you know, I don't often do things the most logical way. So I'm just giving myself props for even trying to say oh my suck again. Oh, except, you know what, I am. I might be scraping off more than I really want to be. So I'm going to tilt the rest of it. Which is going to get some of that, which is cool. Look at that. That is neat. Ooh, I'm liking that. Um, I'm actually going to start... So I'm going to stop it right there. I think I get that white down at that end. And then I'm going to tilt it. Lift a little bit more. color in some other places. Look at that. Woo! Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Wow. And since all this is new, it's hard to know what's doing what. Because I'm using more pouring medium than usual, I'm using new paints. Look at that. There we go. Look at this. Isn't that beautiful? I love, can you see my hands right there? I'm pointing. Oh, there's my finger right there. So cool. And where's my finger again? Right there. If I torch that area, all that color is going to pop up from underneath. And then look at this little area. Oops, wrong direction. All those little cells in the corner. All right, so I'm going to tell myself, don't over tilt. Don't over tilt. It's going to be my mantra. Don't over tilt. Oh my gosh. You guys should see this in person. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. All right, so I mean, I got I to gotta move it some, you know. But I'm going to try not to move it that much because, I mean, right now there's probably too much. Right here I've got a bald spot, so, I mean, I do need... I love this, how it's feathered, or how... And that was from the very beginning, um, when it leaked out, that initial. And then I tilted while it was leaking before I finished doing Oh my gosh, guys. I, I don't even know what's going on. Let's see if I can get the light better. Stuff is just happening right there. hard really even to know what to do right now. I'm 
this something needs to be done about that. But I'm not. Oh, that would be the answer. I like this lightness so much better than all that heaviness. I know I zoomed you like in and out, so let me make sure that you can see the whole thing. There we go. I'm at a, oh my goodness. I don't know where this big blue thing came from, but I don't like it. That seriously just popped up from when I went to fix the, um, oh my gosh, stuff's happening. Oh my god, oh my god. Stuff is like just changing. Look at that blue thing wasn't there. Could it just be these paints? I mean, I've added WD-40 into paints before. Oh, I just spilled the rest of it. I've added WD-40 in. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what it could be. I mean, my paint thickness is, you know, pretty much the same. And See, I don't have, I need sides. Nothing is covered because I'm so scared to tilt. But on the other hand, I don't like this area right here. So, and I don't want to scrape it off. I don't want, oh gosh, let's see. see what would happen if I tried to remove it. Um, this is actually changing more than I would like up here. This blue thing's really weird. So I think I'm going to bring it back towards me. It's okay if this, that is changing and, I mean, it's fascinating, well, it's fascinating watching it change, but I'm not altogether sure I like exactly what it's doing. And I think it's more important that I stretch this other stuff out than I keep that. This is just like a really exciting port to watch. Totally geeking out on it. Okay. This is very pretty. Um, I'm gonna turn it. I'm hoping it still stays in frame. But I need another um, angle. Um, I'm gonna tilt it a little this way to see if I can widen this out 
but if I can't get it to right away, I swear I will stop. Famous last words. It's moving. I think. Maybe not. Maybe it's just my brain. I... I'm not going to do anything about this because it will ruin the rest of the painting and the painting's too cool. But look at this. Like, this just did that. I don't like how heavy this is at all, but I would love for the whole painting to be this, but I'm really worried that if I tilt it, gosh, I really don't want to screw it up. I really think it's too dark. Oh, but look if I... Look at that. It's like doing stuff. Sorry, I just keep staring at it, but... It keeps doing things. And the more I touch it, it's like, like doing this, like it's like little bits of magic are happening. Because what I would love is for this little part to go away and this to stretch out. But that's just, it's just too dangerous, people. You know, it, if I had like an OR team and um, surgical lights, maybe that could be something we could do. But there is something in there, I think. Oh my gosh, this cell right here. Can you guys see this? It just like popped and bloomed and is growing. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm gonna torch it and I can only imagine what's gonna happen when I do that. Out. Um, I really want you guys to see this. You know what I'm going to do? It's probably really stupid of me to do this, but I really want you guys to see what's happening. Hold on. I'm putting this around my neck. And, hang on, I'm taking go, oh man. You should see what I'm doing right now. You know you want to. All right, so I took that glove off with my hand, or with my mouth. All right, I just want you to see close up. And I am so sorry, I know I'm making you dizzy as all heck. And I, re I really know that I'm horrible um, filming this like this. But this is amazing. Okay. Look at that. Hang on, I gotta figure out where I am and where the flame is. This can't be safe by any means. 
but look at that. Alright, now, hang on, I gotta lift this to see where I'm at. Why won't my flame go out? Okay, hold on. Ah! Hang on, look away, look away. That's my leg, I know, I know. Look away, pretend you can't see anything. I will never make it in films. But look at that. This is why I wanted you close up when I torched. I don't know if it is those paints I mean, could this be all from those paints? I mean, if it is, then that is totally worth spending the extra money. I still think that's way too dark, but I am, I, I am in awe. This was so fun to watch. I hope that you guys could see what was happening. So this is it as a whole. As I said, that area is very dark. Um, I would not use that purple again without making it lighter. Um, so, I mean, the colors aren't my favorite. And right here, it's hard. You're lighting. It's hard for you to see, I think. Like, it looks worse through my lens. Maybe it'll look better when it's on the TV. But this is pretty sweet. Thanks for watching.